You are the king. Moment adorable youngster confuses Prince William for the monarch, before the royal kindly corrects him. This is the sweet moment one excited youngster mistakenly thought he was talking to a king during a conversation with Prince William. The Prince of Wales, 40, stepped out at Dal Ice Rugby Club in Merth Eyre Tidfell, alongside the Princess of Wales today, during a visit to meet the Central Beacons Mountain Rescue Team on their whirlwind tour of Wales. He chatted to members of the team as well as their family members, and one child at the occasion seemed very happy to meet a royal, especially when he thought it was a monarch he was in the presence of. You are the king, he told William, who kindly corrected him by saying, No I'm not, not me. My father is. The club is a popular spot where the rescue team socialize and relax when they are off duty. The royal couple greeted members with pizza from the Little Dragon Pizza van in the car park of the club. Earlier in the day, the Prince and Princess of Wales have sailed together off a cliff in the Brecon Beacons, while meeting the mountain rescuers. William and Kate arrived at a wet and windy area of the Banal Brychin Yog near Merth Tidfil in the South Wales Valleys, wearing hiking gear, and put on safety equipment ready for the descent. They were guided through the process by the volunteer-run organization, which responds to calls 24 hours a day, all year round. The group covers the central area of the Banal Brychin Yog National Park which includes Benefand, the highest point in southern Britain and the Stradfelt Waterfalls, and has been keeping the surrounding communities safe for 60 years since 1963. When asked by instructors if he had abs sailed before, William said, it's been a while. Before heading over the edge Kate, who was wearing a red mountain rescue coat like her husband with her hair tied in a ponytail, was heard telling William, we are not racing. They also engaged in other training activities such as medical support exercises and watched a search, dog rescue demonstrations, while hearing from current and former team members about their experiences spanning the organization's six-decade history. Kay took part in a simulated casualty rescue and used a radio to alert her husband to the kit she required. The princess could be heard saying, Do you know what's on the list, over? She added, It's like our weekly shopping list. It's like going to the supermarket. The rescue kit was hastily brought by William, before they both helped put it together so they could evacuate the dummy casualty, who had suffered a leg injury. The royal couple then helped the casualty on a stretcher to safety. The prince is patron of Mountain Rescue England and Wales, and worked closely with such teams during his time as an air ambulance pilot. The prince and princess then met two retired members, Bob Thomas. 75, and Nick Richards, 79, who had been part of the rescue team at the Aberfan disaster in 1966. After leaving the Brecon Beacons, they traveled the short distance to Dalais Rugby Club in Merth Tidful where many of the mountain rescue team socialize when off-duty. William and Kate immediately went to the Little Dragon Pizza van parked in the car park and ordered 12 pizzas to say thank you to the volunteers. The order which included three margarita, three pepperoni, three barbecue chicken and three goat's cheese came to more than 120 pounds. Owner Peter Morris, 45, from Brynmar, and his employee Shannon Stokes, 25, who normally feed walkers and tourists from a spot on the Banau north of Krikoa, said they had fed the rescue team before. Mr. Morris said, there was an incident up in an old quarry which is just behind our pitch where a young boy dislocated his knee. It was a quick call but as a gesture we gave them free pizzas because they work all hours of the day. The Royals carried the pizzas into the rugby club for the rescuers and met other members of the team and community. Before leaving, William and Kate posed for photos and spoke with members of the public who had gathered outside to catch a glimpse of them. East Lecheek, 9 from Merth Eyre, came with her mother Amy, 38, and 10-year-old brother Noah and handed William a letter in which she asked if she could marry Prince George. I love the royal family and I think Kate is beautiful, Isla said afterwards. Detective Constable Carolyn Brown, 50, and Sergeant Claire Edwards, from South Wales Police, were off duty and spoke with William about the coronation. We were talking about the coronation and we said we had been hoping to get an invite to the garden party and William just said, 
Of course and got someone to take our details, Detcon Brown said. We thought we would be cheeky and ask as we're huge royalists. The royal couple will be staying in a local bed and breakfast this evening. 